Traditional economics says that people are generally self-centered and care only about themselves as they push ahead to maximize their incomes and fancy lifestyles. According to that, buying and consuming, shopping for new bag or holidays in a nice place will make you happy. But soon, you're not excited about the bag anymore and you're back from your holiday and you're looking for new goals. In this endless cycle of desire, we are continuously left wanting more without ever finding lasting satisfaction. We chase our dreams of large wealth or great power in the belief that they will bring us lasting happiness. A purchase or promotion gives us a high, yet that high soon wears off and we are off chasing the next high. Who's happy then? A major study found the happiest and healthiest were those who cultivated strong relationships. Time beats money. A number of studies have shown that happier people prefer to have more time in their lives than more money. But it helps to have enough money to pay the bills. People's well-being rises along with income levels up to an annual salary of about $75,000, studies have found. That number probably varies depending on your cost of living, however. It's worth stopping to smell the roses. People who slow down to reflect on good things in their lives report being more satisfied. Acts of kindness boost the mood. It helps to stay in the present, in the moment. Several studies have found that people who practice mindfulness meditation or prayer experience greater well-being. It's all good, but the surprising fact is that a real meaning, the lasting happiness, comes from within yourself. Your heart and thoughts need to be joyful for you to perceive all things joyful. If your thoughts are joyful, then your body, your house and your environment, everything looks so good and beautiful. If your thoughts are not joyful, then you perceive yourself negatively, find faults in yourself and point them out. Even if you make your body and face look great by exercising and putting on makeup, if your thoughts are not joyful, you do not feel joyful while looking at yourself. The same with everything around you. Sounds familiar? That's why you need to make your thoughts joyful, then both people and your environment will all look great. 